Hi, I'm Dale the Insane. Can how's it going? Let me know in the comments with the like button before we get started here playing more Terraria mod. And of course, we're on the world of chaos. And uh, we have things that we're going to do today. We have events. I didn't say bosses. I said events. Well, there's bosses too, kind of. The first thing we're going to need, if you remember, when we went into the dungeon, we grabbed a crap ton of ectoplasm. So that's going to be the first thing I'm going to want to grab. Uh, we have caps on turned on. That's odd. Uh, let's fix that. Next thing we're going to need is silk. Do we really not have any silk? No, we do not. But we do have uh, cobwebs. Like a crap ton of them. So that will be useful. Um, and then we will need pumpkins. So with those cobwebs we have, we're going to run over here to the uh, loom. I think that should be more than enough. With this, we can come over here to our crafting areas. Clicking glove. Interesting. Hold on. Ah, this is what we're looking for. The naughty present. Summons the frost. We're going to need that. And the pumpkin moon medallion. Gonna need that. Pumpkin pie. That sounds useful. Anyway, everything else, you guys can all go in here. Uh, we're not gonna need you now. We have these two. We're going to do the pumpkin moon event first, so we're going to put the naughty present in here. And then, uh, yep. It's almost nighttime. I feel like there is a way to automatically make things go from day to night. Maybe with the abomination? Look in the shop. Uh, forbidden tome. The dark mage. No. Runaway probe, party invite, weather balloon. No. Anyway, I do feel like there is a way to shift things from day to night without having to wait with one of the mods or something that we have. I don't remember it off the top of my head though. But uh, it is almost night. In the meantime, I guess we can talk to the <laughs> Starfarers. Duke Fishron has been defeated. That was a close one. But you're, you've officially won. Boo! Okay, <laughs> I might have fished too hard for that one. You know what? Let's have the pun. Let's leave the puns to Aphrodite. I can see there's a certain skill to it. Okay, let's get going. We meet again in Seneca. Again, I have another foe for you to defeat. I've given you the ancient crown. With it, you can call forth a powerful foe, the burnished king. If my hypothesis is correct, his defeat will resonate a clue towards the first star bearer's location. Prepare yourself. This fight will not be easy. What? We're gonna need that. Let's put it in the, uh, the quest chest. Okay. <laughs> anyway, we've defeated Calamitis, but it was not but a clone of the real foe. Even as a duplicate, it stood as one of our toughest challenges yet. Who knows what the real thing can do? We have to become stronger. Yes, yes we do. We've defeated the Leviathan and Anahita, a battle well fought with the Leviathan up here. When the, the Leviathan appeared, I feared the worst. 
I'll try not to doubt you in the future. After all, you got my help. I am helping, right? Right? Okay, let's get going. Kinda. Let's see if it's nighttime. Yet. Oh. No, it's still daytime. This could be useful. This summoning type gun lets you conjure allies as well as fire at foes directly to shred them apart. Quite effective. Okay, let's get going. This essence has the capability of granting the power of weapon memories to weapons that can't hold them. This sounds very useful. In that case, I shall leave it to you. Essence of the shield. Sounds useful. All right. It is now officially nighttime. And we are about to summon an event. Let's do this. All right. We have the pumpkin mode active. Let's see what we're going to get. that difficult. These people are with two. Scarecrows. Alright. It's the morning wood. You gotta, you gotta really watch out for that morning wood. It's, I don't know what it's morning, but I'm sad about something. I guess all the trees are dead. Yes. Every guy knows how big of a problem morning wood. You know you. Ow! We got dissected by the warning. Oh shit, it's a problem. We got 
got more morning wood. Gravestones here, aren't they? moon has passed so we have sort of survived the night we only died a few times um will we get pagan's grasp 
ignorant Charon's bacon. Dark effigy. Uh, scarecrow shirt. <laughs> Violet dark effigy. Spooky wood. Stuff we have survived. And uh, with that, we can move on. We'll check the uh, checklist here. With that, we have completed Martian Madness, and we defeated the Martian Saucer in a previous video, so that's that event. Here's the pumpkin moon. We have survived it. Beat the morning wood. Beat the pump king. So next, these two would be the, at least three actually, will be the frost moon. Actually, it might be four things here. And also with that, we have now crossed the 50% mark of hard mode. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> We're getting through this. Slowly but surely. One boss, an event at a time. And in some cases, multiples at a time. But, you know, like today. Anyway, that's where we're going to wrap this video up. And I want to thank everybody for watching. But of course, remember to turn on the light and open the door, because you can't have sanity without at least a little insanity. And the game literally just froze af well, as I was doing the outro. God, perfect. That was crazy. It, it crashed. And you're seeing this Elgato screen, because... Anyway, see you guys next time.